Now, the Arts Council of the Brazos Valley has been a leader in the arts community for more than 50 years, and now they're asking the community to help out with this weekend's Boots and Barbecue fundraiser. So here at the Arts Council, what we like to do is make art accessible to all. And we do that through several ways, and that's through funding, promotion, um, making our gallery free to the public, bringing in interesting things, and supporting the arts in all areas. The Council has been a guiding light for those who have found themselves in a dark place and are wanting to change their outlook on life. We team up with the Juvenile Center and we call that program Art for Life. And so we bring in teachers that will teach kids how to do poetry. And with the poetry, they learn how to express themselves through words instead of maybe bad actions and making better choices. Um, we also do like murals and things so they learn how to um, make better decisions through art. Many people underestimate the influence of art. We help on so many levels, not only for um, economic reasons, it teaches kids how to learn different ways. If you look at all the studies that go with your mental health, and to me, creativity is just another tool. You've got to develop it and learn it. This weekend gives the public an opportunity to support the Arts Council and learn more about their underrated impact. What Boots and Barbecue allows is for people to come in, experience the Arts Council, and also help us raise money for all the several programs that we do at a very low cost. So, um, and plus, we have some fantastic barbecue. Andrea Uribe, KAGS News. And tickets for this weekend's event will be available online at the Arts Council's website or in person. And the event will be on from 12 to 3 p.m. Saturday at the Arts Council facility at 4180 South Highway 6.